The back of Hotel Leo is an abandoned lot that serves as a rubbish dump for the neighbourhood. The surrounding streets are crumbling buildings and slums. The crenellated rooftops are occupied by worried cats and bored bats. Body was here. Cussim points to the dent in the garbage bags with the splatters in red. Kothu and Bilal nod. He was thrown from one of those balconies, not by us, right? Bilal nods. Kothu coughs and looks away. So where's the rest of the body? Kothu looks at Bilal, who looks at his feet. It's gone, sir. I'm supposed to give his mother some limbs, a shoulder, and I don't know what that is. How do we prove it's Almeida? Rancho Gorda speaks up. If he was taken in before, his prints will be on file. Kasim shakes his head. I trust our fingerprint department less than I trust you. Where's the head? We threw it in the lake. I don't want to hear it. Get me the head. I don't care if you have to drain the whole stinking bearer. We need it tonight. Kothu picks up the phone in the office and gets Driver Marley out of bed. Kasim lumbers towards the lift. What are we doing, detective? asks Ranchagoda once they're out of earshot. Better put in for overtime, but the... Ranchagoda pauses outside the lift and does not go in. Kasim gets inside and holds it with his finger. What's the issue? Loka, first you say you are transferring away from corpses, now you want to put in overtime? We have our job to do. What's our job? We protect the innocent, says Detective Kasim. I thought we protect the powerful. Do we need to discuss this now? Kasim takes his finger off the button, which causes the doors to close. He curses, sticks his arm out to block the lift's jaws. I'm confused about another thing. Get in the lift now. Are we investigating this? Or covering this up? <laughs>